Hello everybody, how are you doing okay? I'm just sat in my car waiting to go off my first race since February, would you believe? Now, in February I did the Seville Marathon, today I'm doing an 800. Couldn't be any, any different, and not only that, the weather. It's actually been chucking it down with rain this afternoon, and it's going to be chuck, forecast to chuck it down with rain for the rest of the time. So, it's going to be interesting. At least it's only two laps, shouldn't take me too long. I'm up against uh, one guy who's actually older than me, a fifth, about 55, and four under 15s, I think, of which three are women. So, a very select uh, bunch of athletes for my first race since February but anyway look forward to it and I better get going because I need to be there for like a staggered start basis so there's only letting a few people in a time because of Covid restrictions so I think I can only access the track from half six and then you have to sort of warm up in a sector and then you get uh, any certain amount of time to do your race and then leave the, leave the venue so anyway we'll check in when we get there okay see you later bye Well, I've arrived at the uh, track, just about got the, like, the last space I could find in the car park. Absolutely tipping it down. I'm not even sure the race is going to go on ahead. It's so wet. I think if it was a cross country race, it would have been called off all dogs. But anyway, it doesn't all wear the track, but uh, this is ridiculous. But there are obviously quite a few people here waiting to get a race, so uh, I better go and check in. Show winning. It reminds me of when I got to a uh, school cross country race years ago. It was chucking it down like this so badly that the, school, uh, the master said we don't need to get out of the van, and we didn't. So <laughs> it's gonna be another case of it. Anyway, I'm a bit, a bit more, uh, a bit more interested in money than it was then. So uh, right, let's get on with it. Well, um... So the first race has started, and this is. <laughs> Well, I've been a track runner for years. This is possibly one of the worst conditions I've ever known. Hi, Tim. Oh, yeah. But uh, this will be fun. <laughs> Cross the line first. <laughs> it was about 220, 225, 226. Actually, it stopped raining, but uh, took the first lap, sort of did myself a bit, and then took the lead going into the home straight, I think, and then just powered around the last lap. So it was alright considering uh, such a bad weather. All right, well, I'll kit on now and uh, call back later. Bye. So it's coming round in race eight. So we'll make Clive Wickham here at the back in the hitting the vest. Go on, Clive! Clive's struggling for pace in this one a bit. So he's got any recovery in the second lap. Come on, mate. Go on, Clive, get these two. That's a good recovery from Clive actually, he's almost caught the back of them two there. He ain't quite going to do it. But yeah, this makes a run. Oh, I just do a little warm down, I don't know if I can't even want to put my shoes on. These are like the Zoom Victory spikes that I've got on, not the new Zoom X ones, the old fashioned Zoom, I think it's the Victory 3s. Quite hard to get on though, because you quite feel quite small. I've got a UK 13 with no socks, and uh, I don't feel there's a huge amount of room. But if anything, I might get away with a 14, but. Uh, very little hill, so when you're sort of jogging around, it feels like you're, you're running on nothing really. But uh, for an 800, they work pretty well. No excuses. I don't think any shoes would have made much difference in the, in this race. They're always reportedly telling people that you have to follow World Athletics rules and not uh, wear the uh, high cushion shoes, but nobody wears a next of sense in an 800. Maybe they might in a 15, but uh, the 15s are after the eight, but uh, you said they can't, you can't stay around too long, more than half an hour to a race due to Covid, but I'm not sure anyone's really going to be checking, but uh, I don't think I know anyone else is in, in the races anyway, so I might as well push on back and uh, not a bad evening's work, at least I didn't get too wet, got a race in at last and a, and a win, obviously in a graded race. Anyway, hope you found this interesting, see you later then, bye!